Alright, what's going on everybody? It's Midfield Matthew here, and welcome to Let's Play Until Dawn. Now, I've never played this before, um, and I've had it, I've actually had it downloaded for quite some time, maybe like three, four months now, but I'm, uh, I've been looking forward to playing this. I just never got around to playing it, because so much other shit had come around. But now i got some free time, so I thought, why not check out what this game's all about. So, without further ado, let's just go ahead and uh, start a new story. The Butterfly Effect. A tiny butterfly flapping its wings today may lead to a devastating hurricane weeks from now. I mean, it's true. The smallest decision can dramat- Oh. Okay, I guess I didn't want to read that either. Your actions will shape how the story unfolds, obviously. Oh, I see what it's doing. Your story is one of many possibilities. I've never really been into these games uh, all too much, the decision-based games. But I'm willing to give it a shot. Oh shit. 2015. Six years ago, my guy. Might I add, six years ago. When this shit came out. Oh my god, a butter knife. Oh my god, I can't believe you actually did this. Don't you guys think this is a little bit cruel? Oh, come on, she deserves it. It is not her fault that she has a huge crush on my Hannah's been making moves on him. I'm just looking out for my girl, Em. Just because he's class pres doesn't mean he belongs to everyone. Mike is my man. Hey, Em, I'm not anybody's man. <laughs> Whatever you say, darling. Huh? I'm just kidding. I'm interested in seeing what this game's all about. I'm getting Friday the 13th vibes, like, more than anything else right now. That face, though. Oh my God. <laughs> She's here. Shh, shh. Mike. Oh fuck. What's up, bitch? I'm here to fuck. Oh, oh. Hey, oh. It's me. Are we gonna have sex now? Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. It's Jason. Oh, sorry. Said it just be us this weekend. Yeah. Josh. Are you dying tonight, dog? Oh, oh, it's me now. Okay, thank God it's not incredibly slow like uh, Mando Madan. Jesus. Anything to interact with over here? Where you go, boy? Honest, charitable, funny, brave, romantic, curious. Hannah and her have the best relationship, and it looks like Emily and her have the least. Maybe Ashley and Emily are like the same for her. So these are all of the tote. Ooh, this is going to be fun. There's a lot. There is a lot to look at here. Ooh, this is going to be a big game. Ah, uh, ooh. Uh, well, we're in it now. We are in it now. Use the right stick to look around objects that 
that glint can be, can be ex inspected. Uh oh. I know, I know. I know how to play these games. Jamai Craig. Jeez, Josh. Why Josh, you all day again? Outdone us all. Oh. No, he's dead. You killed him. What is this? He looks so damn hot in that shirt, but I bet you're even hotter out of it. Come to the guest bedroom at 2 a.m. Winky face. Oh, my God. What did our naive sister get herself into now? I bet there's no one else here. Got your note. Glad you can make it. <laughs> Maybe we should start with a little. <coughs> what are these faces, dog? And see where it goes from there. Oh, hell yeah. Oh my god. She's taking her shirt off. What? Oh my god. Matt, what are you doing here? Uh, Hannah. I'm sorry, Hannah. Hannah. Hey, this is all good. Oh just a stupid prank. Uh, oh, hey, you guys are jerks. You know that? Hannah! You fucking bastard. Well, she's dead. She was what? Oh. Oh, this is where... Well, I'd say wait, Josh. Or anything. Josh. Josh. Oh, you fucked it up. Hannah! What's going on? Where's my sister going? Jesus. It's fine. She just can't take a joke. <laughs> it was just a prank, Han. What did you do? We were just messing around, Beth. It wasn't serious. You jerks! Hannah! Hannah! Beth, they're gonna die. So, should we go after her? You know, I kind of think you're the last person she wants to see right now, Mike. Oh shit. Okay, here we go. This is gonna be fun. Ooh, fuck. Uh, oh, uh, 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 uh. Stay. Or, no, fast. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, I'm scared. What's gonna happen? Follow footprints, dog. You mean follow noise? Nah. Never follow noise. What the hell are you talk about? Noise gets you nowhere. Footsteps lead to the path of. Oh. Can y'all help me? Oh. Jesus. Fuck. Shit. Can y'all help me? I'm. I'm. A, I'm looking for my. I'm looking for my friend. Where are you? Come back. Well, so far, I mean... Oh. Wow, this game is, uh... Hannah! Oh, I can... Damn, that's a bright-ass flashlight on this phone! Holy shit. I mean, shit, dog. Anything at all. Anything at all. Oh my Jesus. GameStop. Why? Oh, get that ass walking, boy. Get that ass walking, boy. Hello? Hello? Hi. Sorry, sister. Ain't nobody here. <gasps> oh, fuck. What is this? Oh, totem pole? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. 
Oh, we found the death totem. Indigenous. I believe that butterflies brought dreams and. Pre oh, premonition. That's what I thought it said. I just can't read. Each totem piece foretells a possible future event. How you play will determine whether or not these prophecies come true. As you unlock totems, the events of the past will become clear. Pardon me. Well then, that was uh, that was nice. That was great. I thought that was a shoe. I can see that being a shoe uh, from that angle. Huh? Oh no, she's dead, Chief. Just go back. Not just go back. Go back, Chief. She's dead. She dead. She's definitely dead. Fuck her. Just fuck her, dude. She's dead. From seeing that? Nah, Chief. Nah, just... Yeah, don't... I don't want to know what that was. Can, do we, can, can we go back? Is there an option to just say we don't need a sister anymore? I mean... Anna. Anna. Hello? What the fucking hell are you doing, dog? Anna. Oh my god, you must be freezing. Here. I'm such an idiot. I'm so dumb. Nah, you're dead. Hannah? Nah. <laughs> they all are both dead. Nah. Aw, oh, you lost your phone, you idiot. Guys, we both died. I say that's a win. No, I'm just kidding. Before we begin, there are a few things I need to make sure you understand. Oh my God, that you wait. See, no one could change what happened last year. That voice. Beyond our control. That voice. We accept this in order to move forward. But there is freedom. This revelation. That Everything was you do, so familiar. You make from now on will open doors to the future. I want you to remember this. I want you to remember this as you play your game. Every single choice will affect your fate and the fate of those around you. That. Well, back up, Chief. So, you have committed to commence with this game. Hell yeah. Where are you? 14 minutes in, buddy. And I want to help you see it through. Sometimes, sometimes these things can be a little scary, even terrifying, but I'm here to make sure that no matter how upsetting things may get, you will always find a way to work through it. Hmm? All right. We will start with a simple exercise. Could you please pick up card? And I want you to look at the picture on the other side and tell me what you feel about it. It is essential that you answer honestly in order to get the most out of it. This voice sounds so familiar, but who the fuck are you? Uh-oh, okay. So, how did that picture make you feel? Remember, be honest. Uh, I feel uneasy. Okay, 
honest to his gut. What do you think it is that makes you feel uneasy? That's a scarecrow, though. I don't like that at all. Let's see. I see. Let's see. The scarecrow were not there. Would you feel comfortable staying there on your own for a period of time? Say a week, for example. I wouldn't. Oh, no? Why not? I'd be scared, bro. Straight up. Is there something else in that picture that scares you? No, it's not in the picture. It's what could be there besides that. I'm not sure, honestly. That's interesting. Well, I'm afraid we're out of time for now. But please, I would like you to contemplate what it is that it's missing from that picture. Hmm? The thing that's driving you fear. We need to unwrap it. Don't you agree? But the next time. the beginning? No, Chief. Super massive games. Give me a massive retina. Let me stop myself right here. No, we died. We died. We definitely died, dog. Our back got broke on a rock. We're dead. We're considering as a person of interest, but his whereabouts are currently unknown. He has an interesting history with the Washington family. He had warned them against pursuing their construction project and claimed the land was sacred to his forefathers. You know, there is still the old sanatorium on the mountain. Could he be hiding there? My officers did search the grounds, but the girls themselves couldn't have made it that far. Something about that mountain seems to breed tragic events. Thank you for joining us, Anthony. With all the Washingtons tonight, with their son Josh, on this, the anniversary of the mysterious disappearance of Hannah and Beth Washington. Well, hello, friends and fans. All right, let's do that again. All right. Well, hello, friends and fans. It's beyond awesome to have you guys all back this year. Um, first off, I gotta say, I'm super excited. He looks just like someone who, like, the annual Blackwood winter getaway. <laughs> so, um, let me just let you know, uh, let's take a moment to address the elephant in the room for a second. I know you're all probably worried about me, and I know it's gonna be tough on all of us going back after what happened last year, but... I just want you all to know, um, it means, it means so much to me that we're doing this, and that uh, I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together, 
and I'm thinking of them. I really want to spend some quality time with e each and every one of you and um, just share some moments that we'll never forget for, for the sake of my sisters and, you know. Okay, so let's party like we're fucking porn stars, okay? Make this one trip we will never forget, all right? Yes! Can you smile? Oh, I'm just kidding. Sorry. 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 Also featuring Larry Fessenden. A total score by Jason Graves. Yeah, oh, what's up? I'm not in church. So far, we're off to a bang and start, dog. Chapter one, Memento Mori. Oh, well, we're here. I gotta be kidding me. I just came here to see my friends put the butter knife down. Sam. And his best friend, diligent, considerate, adventurous. Okay. Cool. Hello? Hi! Someone there? Yeah, I'm here. What's up? Well, it appears we're starting the game, but... I'd say this is a great time to uh, end the episode. The very first episode. Oh boy, we're in for something real special here. So, ladies and gentlemen, we will continue this on the next episode. Uh, I'm I'm excited. I'm really excited to see what I'm really excited to see what this game has got for me, for us. Uh, but anyways, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later.